Hello, my name is Johnny. Welcome to more Marvel Character Talk. Uh, we're going to look at some covers here from Captain America. Uh, if you'd like, please subscribe, hit that notification bell, like, reply, and share. Might be sending these in to have them um, CG seed. It's going to take a long time because I always have them pressed too, so it extends the time uh, a great amount. It's the first issue in his own magazine at last. The big premiere issue. Black Panther looking really cool on there. He's like Giant Man. Uh, there's uh, Agent 13, also known as Sharon Carter. That's a Mariner and his Jack Kirby cover. And then we've got uh, the first Falcon. Coming of the Falcon. Uh, this is from 69. See the price that changed from 12 cents to 15. Inflation had started. Uh, we've got some of the Red Skulls uh, henchmen in the background. And I believe that's a Gene Colan cover. So, pretty nice. And these are, are in just okay shape, but sending them in, they're still to preserve them when they're put in that. And then... Uh, the resale value of these would probably be a few hundred, depending on what they get. I don't know if this one's like a four or so. And then this one's kind of, uh, I don't know if you say it's faded. It's sort of discolored or something. It looks darker in real life than it seems to be showing up when I'm filming it. Uh, classic covers. Uh, so that's some nice Captain Americas. I never did have, uh, when I was buying them, things from the 60s and 70s, super mint ones. They were just hard to hard to find. And, and even if they were around, uh, then the price was that much more, whatever level it was at. So I always went with a, a lower price. So it was a lot to collect. All righty, until next time, more Marvel character talk. Uh, looking at some classic covers and things might send in to CGC. Thanks for watching.